What's up? I'm Tony. I'm here with Mike G and his posse, also known as Part of Odd Future. And we're here in Sydney, Australia. And they created a store right here, right? Just a store like for the week. Is that right? Yeah, I don't know how long. Look, if we don't make good money by Sunday, we gonna close this shit. If it's good, we gonna let it go for as long until we start seeing we gonna be broke. It seems good. There's a line around the block. Yeah, it's just cool. Just to get in here. Just to get in to buy stuff, right? I know. That's crazy. Sick. I like all the shirt designs. Yeah, they're pretty cool. Like the cross and then like the two gay cats. Ooh, it's pretty sick. What's the inspiration? Um, really, I get inspiration from meth and like, <laughs> I like cats a lot and I'm not playing. And you're selling it. You're making money off it. Hell yeah. I'd be at home bored just making shit with cats on it and keep it by I'm stoked. You know what's funny? Like, like I drew that. I have nice versions of this. Yeah. And that was one I just drew. Like, I actually spray painted that shit. And for some reason, we just took, a, got a picture, cut it out, and just start using that for some reason. I don't know why. Maybe we're too lazy to actually just put the nice one. It's not even hard. I mean, we got scanners. It, oh, we fail. It's not hard to draw that one in a yellow shirt. <laughs> it's not a yellow shirt. <laughs> I bought. I got him. I tricked Tony off. So we're on Big Day Out, and uh, these guys are playing, playing other shows, playing Big Day Out too. But I know you guys are into skating. Which came first, skating? He's the best one. Music. Uh, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Nah, uh, I did music, and then. I got into skateboarding because uh, my friends did. And this is around like Tony Hawk Pro Skater 4 around 2002. As corny as that sounds, <laughs> that's my shit. And then it's from there on that all my friends did. Skating, so, yeah. yeah. By the way, Tony Hawk Underground is, the, is in my top three of games ever. Oh, wow, thank you. Yeah. So you guys watch skate videos? Uh, yeah. Shout out to Dylan Reader, my nigga. <laughs> Dylan Reader, I'm here for you, dog. Rolling my pants legs up, bro. I hope you see this. You ever know after he does every trick, he like yeah. does this little thing with his arm. He was, he was, uh, when he was like 10 years old, he was an amateur for our clothing company. Word? Yeah, yeah. there was like this group of kids that were all like around that age. Riley was one of them, David Loy was one of them. Oh, shit. That's um, hard. Tyler Bledsoe. Oh, like, that nigga, he don't wear his glasses no more, huh? No. Yeah, he not that nigga glasses. started getting high as fuck and said, fuck that. <laughs> <laughs> what music, like, have you been inspired by? Through ski videos. Dude, as black as it sound, that nigga TK part in Baker 3, <laughs> that fucking, uh, do that man in my, man, man, when you talk about the ribs, oh, that fucking song is so fucking tight. Dude, it's the most well, ignorant geez, song uh, ever, and it's so tight. And nigga, then, you know the fucking game. <laughs> well, all these girls run this thing, dude. I don't know the lip, he's doing lips, doing lips and blunts off the It's so tight. Yeah. <laughs> Nick Tucker uses a lot of my music. Pretty sick. So when okay, if someone asks you to use me as a skate video, they don't even ask. They, they just do it. do it, and I be stoked as fuck to like know somebody yeah. use that shit. Uh, I mean, I just that's, that's all I grew up. Attitude. That's all I grew up around. So to know, like, that's like a hobby for me. That I just grew around that all my life. So whenever people use like my skate like songs in their fucking parts and shit, I be stoked as fuck. I just think that shit like, I mean, I'm not gonna name drop, but I have a big artist, like a really big artist who wants to buy some of my artwork. I never put it in the uh, online, it's just some shit I made. And he was like, how much do you want for it? Name a price. And it's not really about that. I'm just going to give it to him because I just think it's cool that somebody actually wants that shit I just made when I was bored. So are there any other albums coming out from Odd Future crew? Um, Hellboy. Hellboy. He released a his hood album called Hood Niggas. In the, in the hood section. In the hood section. You go to the club with that. Clancy, him right there in a the gray shirt. Releasing a country album. Yeah, he's releasing a jazz album <laughs> called Slide It In Slow. <laughs> Mike G, he's releasing a reggae tone album <laughs> called Mike G's Greatest Hits. <laughs> yeah, he's going to be a model. He's going to get the cover of GQ. Uh, it's coming out like a month or so. So really branching out. Yeah. Show what you're going to show him on GQ. Show what you gonna show him on the show. Oh, 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 fuck. Sorry. See, that could have been for your mouth.
That would have been yours.